Hello. Hello. Have you just seen? Hello. So where have you been on holiday? Uh, Malaga. Did you? Who did you go there with? Just mum and dad. Very nice. What was it like? It was lovely. Very hot though. That's what you want, isn't it? <laughs> I can't deal with it. <laughs> um, right, did you want to move on to join the slip roads or not? Have you done any driving since I've seen you? No. <laughs> she's had a big break, so she's been on holiday. <laughs> Might be a bit rusty to start with, but she should be all right. Mm -hmm. yeah, everything sorted? Mm -hmm. What did we do last time? Is it a controlled stop in the central reservations? Yeah, I remember you done well with the controlled stop. and learned it really quickly. What about the um, central reservations? Did you understand that? I think so, yeah, yeah. it's just, it just just that area threw us off a little bit. It's hard work. Mm. Right, well, today, we're, you know them slip roads you done last week, mm -hmm. uh, the last two weeks ago, what did you have to do if you couldn't go? Do you just slow down or and stop? And stop. But these ones, there should be no stopping mm -hmm. unless they stopped on the carriageway. So what have we got to do with your speed going down there? Do you match the speed of it? You do. Now keep left so you can build a picture up, put your signal on nice and early. Mm -hmm. If you see the red car is really small, what does that mean? You can pull in. If the red car is big but not getting any bigger. Then you can pull in. If it's getting bigger. Uh, hang back a bit. Off gas. If it moves into the right lane. Then you can pull over. Good. Any questions about that? No. And then we're just going to focus on that because it's only an out there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And when we leave, um, when would you signal to leave if you were doing 70? Would you do it at the three lines? Good. And if you're only doing 50? Set two lines. And the 30, you probably do it at the 100 yard marker. Um, now, when we're on the fast moving roads, we need to keep a two second gap. Can you tell me how you judge that? Do you pick a point where the car passes and then count two seconds? You do. So, as soon as the, when I use the white line, so as soon mm -hmm. as I get level with a white line, mm -hmm. count to two seconds, I say that rhyme only if full breaks the two second rule. Now, if you've said it and you're only there, you've not reached the marker point, what does that mean? Yeah, two close. No, if you oh. two seconds, so if you say only a fool breaks the two seconds, that means you've counted the two seconds, mm -hmm. but you've not reached the marker point. So that means you've got a... Speed up. Oh, slow down. No, you've got a good cap. Oh. <laughs> so, if I line that blue cap, the white line, then takes two seconds to say only a fool breaks the two second rule. Mm -hmm. So I've counted the two seconds, I've not reached the marker point. That means I've got a good two gap. gap. But... If I count the two, so if I start to count two seconds and I've reached the gap but I've not counted the two seconds, what does that mean? You're too close. What happens to the gap and work with it? Um, does it get bigger? It doubles to four. four. And then the other thing what we're going to do is a spiral roundabout. Uh, it's a bit of a nightmare this one, but all I want you to do is just look for them so I can get the right picture up. Right there. So, can you see that? You're coming round in the right lane. What's it doing? Merging in the middle. So it's open up in two lanes. So which one you're going to take? Middle one. That's it. Got that? Yep. So we'll just focus on them today because I want to get them learned. When you're ready. I'm not worried about all the time I'm going to get. Mm. No. Take your time to get back in the swing of things. Because you normally have a mare when you've had a week. <laughs> Did the rents enjoy the holidays? Oh, I loved it, yeah. Did they? When did you get back? Uh, Friday. And you've been back straight back to work? Uh, yeah. I'll be ready if anybody comes around the corner. Yeah. Oh, I had a feel yesterday. Guy, oh, no, no faults on the sheet, right? And on a, one part of a stretch of a road, he tries to drive like an old granny. And oh the examiner gives him a serious fault for it. No fault, you know, just one serious. Well, the kid's been on the road a couple of days earlier. 
Which way are you going at this one? Um, next one. Next one. Damn, it was painful. I've been thinking about it all morning. So you should be back on this side of the lane. I think we could have gone there. Oh, we were worried about stolen. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, stick your handbrake on now then. Turn it with the gas ready. Video, I seen that horrible stall, so I looked at three times. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so that'll teach you. So we're going right at the lights. Okay. Now you wouldn't indicate until you get past the garage, would oh, you? Oh, yeah. It's a bit fast, this. Okay, do you need now? Tell people where you go. Lift one's clutch up before you go on the gas. Well, you just get a bit rusty, didn't you? <laughs> get me faster because I want you to judge this two second gap. So, can you line this fine 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 up with centre line and count at two seconds? Get me to 50. Right, tell me how many seconds there is between us and that far. Thank you. 
get forward to six point six wiggle. They can't see it. Uh, they're doing about oh I'd say about that looks pretty clear, doesn't it? So get me at least fifty down here. They're doing about sixty, so get your foot down. So use your right door now, put the signal to the right. Can you join? I showed you on the iPad where it's split into two. You look for that when you go to the roundabout. So remember, you don't like looking at road markings, do you? Take a nose back on and watch the road markings as you come down here. It's exactly the what I showed you on the iPad. Good. Now we'll leave 
looking at the next exit and I want you to leave in the right lane again. So if they're breaking you should be doing the same. Now we're getting a bit close. Do the slip run on your own or do you need prompts? Sure. We're going to have a go on the own now, so I'm putting my hat on, yeah? <laughs> so if you're getting no help, I'm getting um, prepared for this. Do you like it? Love it. <laughs> it's all yours. that one did we? Yeah. Um, so he was just waiting for you to join but that was all good. Try 6k have we been in it before?
six gear again. And then have a look in the dorm room and then if it's safe just move on.
doesn't split, it's an to take up. Right one off to the second exit, what do you do? If you take the right third exit, you go with the left lane, don't make it too late. So count them as you go around. Somebody there, and you wouldn't put it on if you wanted to take it. 
a spiral roundabout. Now, when you approach it in the right lane, if it says you can use the, if it splits in a two, and then walk and say you can use the left or the right, which one's the best one to pick? Left, good. So we'll go right, fourth exit for Durham. So look for Deham on the road, and if it splits in a two, and it's in both lanes, take up the left lane. for yourself now there's nothing wrong with this lane board you've now got to change lanes I would have picked that one mm -hmm. keep your car safe so should I put it into car on the left or? no where are you going at the roundabout right right so you won't put an indicator on for left but I would have had the in that lane I would have had the indicator on for right so you've got to count the exits now you've got to change your lanes had you picked that lane it would have led you straight off the roundabout mm -hmm. But you've done nothing wrong, we're just making hard work for yourself. So why would I change lanes? Uh, if it's safe, you could change the lanes after the third. If it's not, you're going to have to leave in the right lane. So after the third exit, if it's safe, then move over, move over. If it's not, you're going to have to leave in the right and then get back the left as soon as it's safe. Right, rest your feet. Turn that camera off, was there? Right, like that. So, was it, if that's your camera, if that's the camera. There's a button there. Press it for three seconds. Two. It's about there, look. Just press it underneath. Oh, underneath. Underneath. Can't find it. Just there, look. Just press it. This is. There you go. That'll do. Right, I think you've done a day then. Alright. It was alright, a bit <laughs> brutal with the pedals as usual, but I'm not making use of the gears there. Um, is there any questions about joining? That was alright, that, that I thought was alright, yeah. yeah. Um, what about the two second gap? You know how to judge that now? Mm -hmm. What about leaving the carriage wheel? When do you signal? Um, if you go on 70 or 60, do you do it? But the three. 300 for this 70, yeah. And then if it's 40 or 50, do you do it at the two lines and then it's 30, you do it at the one line? Yeah. And when you overtake, 
How would you know when to move about the left? Oh, you can see the uh, headlights in there. And tell me how you judge that two second gap. Do you pick a pot, like one of the white lines on the road? Yeah. Pick a point where the car or a passes. sign or something, yeah. Yeah, and then count two seconds. Good. Right, um, now it's your choice now. If we can do the spiral roundabouts and some motorways, or you can move straight on the manoeuvres. What do you want to do? I'll do some motorways. Do you want to do the motorway? Mm -hmm. Right, well, I've got it. Uh, this is the route what I do with every mm -hmm. But you've been on the motorway already, mm -hmm. that's what I'm asking for. So if you don't I'll, want I'll to. give it another go. You want to give it a go? So well, you'd probably do it all on your own, and it is a hard route what yeah. I do here. Yeah? Yeah. 